Welcome back, CBUSI and Games. We're back in the arena with another historic brawl deck. Tonight, we are going to be piloting Galta, the Primal Hunger. Next up on our randomizer here, this dinosaur is a 12-12 trampler for 12 mana, but it is cheaper if uh, with the total power of creatures you control. So it is a very creature-heavy theme deck that takes advantage of cards like ooh, Lurking Predators, very unique uh, enchantment, much better in multiplayer, but uh, for six mana, it says whenever an opponent casts a spell, you reveal the top card of your library. If it's a creature card, put it on the battlefield. So we're just going to be playing some dinosaurs and stuff and some big creatures and uh, try to pump this guy out as early as possible and uh just just pound face with big 10 tens and 12 12s and ooh the mogs <laughs> so let's uh let's see how far we can get with this let's go play some games all right we're going first what are we playing against rafine the scheming seer ah, right out of the new set okay well, let's just start playing some dinosaurs, shall we? With our dinosaur hand. Perfect. It's just a 3-3, you know, with Defender. That, uh, cannot attack. <laughs> Unless we control a creature with power 4 or more. All right, let's continue playing dinosaurs. Pass the turn. What does Rafine do? Flying Ward 1, whenever you attack, target attacking creature connives X, where X is the number of attacking creatures. Oh. Okay. That's kind of cool. A creature or a land that isn't a mana ability draw card. Really? Really? Um, I think we're probably gonna be drawing cards here. Oh, if we play this, we can attack with both of these. But uh, I think we want to play cards or draw cards. Draw cards. Draw cards. Okay. Perfect. Oh, look at this guy. The want to be dinosaur. Hmm. Oh boy, thief of sanity. Okay, well. Do we just migration's path? Do we play Knight of Stampede? What do we do? Um. I think we start by playing Once Upon a Time. We want to hit a land. Perfect. Okay. Let's, um... Kind of want to Reclamation Stage that's Arcane Signet. Uh, let's just play this. Alright. Let's beat in there. Let's get him. Ooh! Our Galta now cost four. Pretty sweet. Maybe we'll play this next turn. Ooh, if we hit a land, we could play this and this and activate this. All oh, to get to steal something. Was it the top card? Top three. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh. N okay. Um. We will decline this time. So I think we play this. Let's see what they want to do. Counter spell. Okay. Okay. Well, then we play this. 
Bam. Smashy smash. They're at 10. What? Solemn not attacking, not blocking. I don't really understand what Solemn's doing here. Yep. Ouch. Hmm. <laughs> oh. Something good. Oh my goodness. So we got three blockers. What did we get? We just got this thing. I decline. Okay. Okay. Um we got four fours over there. Play this. Play this. Ooh. It is a dinosaur. So we have five, six mana, seven, eight. So we would have to draw a land to play this next turn. Eh. Eh. I don't think so. that maybe we just get in there with this guy boom oh no they block okay hmm. well maybe I should have cycled this to draw land I don't know Well, I wonder what else they got from us with this Thief of Hope. We cycle this. They get another treasure, don't they? Oh boy. That's a big one. Hmm. Well, I don't think I'm going to cycle. There's an 8 8 flying trample. Sixteen total toughness. Our land, all of our land. Okay. Um. Do we pay? I don't think so, because I want to rumble in with everything. Thirteen. 16, 20, 27, 32, decline. Okay. Haste. 
Alright. This should be enough. If they don't have a trick. Although... Yep, yep. I realize this tramples, right? So that's nine. So they're they're dead. Okay. Yay! Look at his draw card. No, uh, we're not going to. We're not going to draw a card. <laughs> I, I don't want them casting anything. It has to be two. Perfect. We got him. Boom. All right. Classic mono white versus mono green. Oh, yeah. Lurking predators. Probably won't see a play because of Thalia. Makes these spells cost more. Um, oh, they are on the play. Oh boy. So we are already at a large disadvantage, especially with this card. Yep. Good news, we do get to play Goreclaw. No box. Awesome. Goreclaw. Bam. Of course. <laughs> Curse of Silence. Not my dinosaur! My dinosaur. Let's so play this dinosaur. Boom! And we are good to stay. So they can. Pay for life to make this indestructible. What are they doing? Nothing. They're doing nothing. So I think we played this. Oh yeah. We play this. Draw a card. Awesome. And we're still doing nothing. So we can, I think we're just going to take advantage of work of Moldaya. Yup. Then I think we'll play Land of War Elves. Oh my gosh. And we'll play this. Yeah, draw your card. This is our land. Okay. Do I want to attack with this? So it's first strike. And they can just pay for life. Yeah, I think so. That's fine. Oh, there we go. We got them. Ha ha. All right, another pretty decent opening hand here. 
Nice. We just need a dinosaur to play this. Start with this. Playing against Silvala, Heart of the Wilds. Okay. Alright. Well, I don't think we're going to attack into that 1-1. One -one. So, come on land. Oh, we did get a dinosaur. Nice. Maybe we should have played this. Yeah. I'm guessing the beast is coming down. Yep. Okay. Well, what are we gonna do? They have a five five. We can match it with our five four. This will grow. So we do nothing. I think we're just gonna take the hit from this. So we can play this plus this next turn. Yeah. Hmm. Oh boy. Let's tap up to one elf, that elf, and a random elf creature card in your hand. Get plus one plus one. And then seek an elf. Oh, and then they get Regal Force at six. Holy moly. Oh, yeah. All right. Um, can't make headway with this. I can definitely. Maybe I sh should. No, I don't. Hmm. Two. So trading here would be bad with this. This would be okay. I don't think we attack. I'm gonna flip this. Cost seven to flip. Hmm. We have five minutes. Okay. We have a thirteen five. Doesn't do anything else, does it? Can I jump here. I don't know. I really want to come in and make sure they don't get a regal force and refill their hand. <laughs> Magic bears fruit. Oh, that's nice. Oh, well, that stinks. <laughs> yep. Mana. Oh my goodness. So they go get a green creature and oh sure. Who Ho oof I think that's game. <laughs> Ooh -ho -ho. That's so good. Wow. If they can untap this again. Oh my gosh. Ah, well. Well. Why did they attack with every. Oh, this could not. Attack. We're at one. 
Woohoo! <laughs> mm hmm. Got us. Let's bounce back from that defeat and attack this Chulane Teller of Tales. Okay. Oh, we turned too late. Maybe I should have held it in my hand for a guardian project. And maybe. Oh my gosh. These cards are coming to turn too late. What the heck? <laughs> well, we'll get in there for two. Boom! Is this a creature heavy deck? Is it just uh, Bant control? Oh, okay. Aya. So I think we just attack with that. Good, good. So if we play this next turn, this is two mana, so we could. Yeah, that's gonna be a real good next turn. Well, that was a good turn for that. I do enjoy me an Uro. Wow. Alright, so we'll draw a card. Awesome. Play a land. Play this. Draw another card. Boom. And smash for eight. Wow, that was quick. Alright. I do like me this card in this kind of format. Pretty good. So we got Pack Leader, Leaf Gilder. We'll keep this. I think we'll play this first. If we don't draw one drop. So we can play this on turn three. I think that'd be smart. Maybe we could play all the things. Maybe even ramp. I don't know. Playing against a control deck, so. I'm gonna get our card advantage when we can. So the creatures have to enter the battlefield. And they have to be non-token. Okay. There we go. Our opponent scries with the treasure map. And it says, um, when it has three counters or more, um, you'll flip this to, uh, to the treasure's cove where you can sacrifice treasures to draw a card. Well, well, well. That was not very nice from our opponent. I think we will take care of Teferi. There we go. Only time will tell. Ooh, okay. Yep. Seems pretty good. Oh, nice. So we get two cards off of this. One and two. Well, I mean, we got land. <laughs> we want more creatures. Does this have to attack for its ability to trigger? Whenever werewolf pack leader attacks, if you attacked with the creature, total 
creatures in total cost oh, six good. are great at this, this combat draw card. Oh, okay. Somewhere. Uh, I don't know what these planeswalkers do. Draw cards. Um, I guess we can go this. Yep. Yep. This. Draw some cards. One. There's another one. And then this. Look at us. Yeah, we get that to grow. Alright, so smash. If they have like a lightning bolt or something, we'll probably want to smash with both here. Any sort of removal on any of those, probably not good. Okay, so they're just going to flip this. Nope, I mean, just go up to two counters. Okay, Thank you. well, You've shown me where yeah, I discard three cards. So, I'm thinking... This card, this card, and forest. All right. We can kick this next turn. Right? No, we don't have enough mana. Oh, well, everything's dying. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Okay. So we rebuild. Um. we have to play it this way. Start there. Play this. Yep. Do the things. Scry. Oh, that's so good. I want to draw that. Get the city's blessing. Pass the turn. Well, they haven't done anything to our enchantments yet. So... It's almost safe to say that, like, just playing this... Be really good. So this will go up to ten, and then I can play this. Right, so go to combat. I don't think it's gonna. I think it will block. Never mind. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll just go grab more land. I don't think we're gonna get a chance to kick that anymore. Get smashed for seven. Awesome. I still have five cards in their hand. Hmm. about that they restocked their hand pretty pretty good oh good so that is probably another wrath um this 
How much does it cost? It costs six manas. Alright, I'm gonna put that to the bottom. Draw a card. Perfect. So this costs six manas to activate. I guess I'll just I can't. Go to combat. Man. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Alright, in turn. <laughs> Rivers Rebuke. Come on. <laughs> oh. All right. Play this. I don't think we need to draw cards right now. I think they have that uh, three mana counter spell that they can foretell. I forget the name of it. So I guess we're just going to play this. Boom. Oh my gosh, it's so good. <laughs> um. Go ahead, counter spell it. Nope. Perfect. Next. So what is this card? Is it the four mana draw two card then? Or maybe it's Doomscar. It is Doomscar. Boop. Hmm. Sure. Eight cards in hand. Whether friend or foe, state your okay. intent. Let me help you practice. Oh, maybe we play lurking predators now. Can we play both? So we have 11, 12, 13. So this is five. That would be 11. We can play both. Pass the turn. What does this ultimate do? Whenever you cast a nine creature spell, this emblem deals two damage to any target. I mean, we're at 11. Kinda gotta get in there. Well, we do have an ultimate to take care of that, so we'll never get to ultimate. Plus lurking predators? Maybe they just don't play any spells. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. By all means. We're thinking over here. So two, four, six, seven. What do they have? 
Oh. Oh, can't be kidding me. All right. Six. Just gonna get burned out. Yep. Strike with the cunning mind of the dragon. Really? <laughs> I guess I'll keep that on top. Destroy all non land permanents. I need some time alone. <laughs> Meanwhile, their hand size is ridiculous. Alright. Go on our turn. Play some cards. Play. Um, cards. Here we go. Start with this. And this. Yep. And this card. And pass it through. Oh, we're at six. So we can, we can get burned out easily. I don't think we have any ways to gain life in this deck. I lied. We do have ways to gain life. Just five. <laughs> huh. Oh, sure, sure, sure. Now they have an eight eight. Okay, itself gives it hexproof, so not this. Okay. Oh, and an Ugin. Oh boy. We have targets with Ulamog. Definitely have targets. Can't get rid of this. This one right here. Oh, you brat. Maybe I um get rid of that with this. Uh, I, I, I don't know. Okay. Ooh. Alright. We're gonna get rid of this and this. Booyah. I'm gonna draw some cards. Do I hold out for Besiju? Or I think we play this so we can draw more cards. Kind of fill our hand back up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That sounds like a good idea. Alright, cool. And then we still have enough mana for this. Or this. Oh my gosh. Uh, no attacks. Prompt a wrath from our opponent. Oh my gosh, they're tapping out. This must be like a giant draw X spell or deal X damage. Could be dead. Nope. Maybe. Something's going on. <laughs> what are they doing? going on finale of revelation they're drawing their whole deck what do they got look at their hand that's crazy x is 10 or more i'm tap up to five and you have no more. hmm well <laughs>
fairy. Okay. Oh, please put Wilmod back. Yes! Yes! That makes me happy. What is going on? <laughs> They didn't even attack. Crazy guy. Alright, um we can gain some life. Make some four four. We can do a lot of things. We can uh we can play this card. And draw some cards. We can play Ulamog again. And exile I don't even know. I'll start with this. Boop. Perfect. Draw some cards. We can... Four manas. Let's see. Um... Kind of want to play... I'm going to play this bad boy. Alright. Yep. And yep. And I guess we play this. Alright. Oh, we had an extra mana. Could have played something else. Oh well. So we'll pass the turn. We'll discard five cards. One, two, three, four. There we go. Yes. And they're digging through their deck again. Try to get Rivers Rebuke. Okay. There's Elf's ECD, as they call it. Elspeth's Conqueror's Death. Yup. There goes that. That is... That is gone. That is not coming back. No! How dare they? That is my life gain. Hmm. Blue. We can blow this up. We can go to our turn. I think I want to play this. Okay. So we are... Gaining life and let's just destroy this. There we go. Awesome. And let's uh gosh, I let, let's see what we can find. Stainful stroke. That's not nice. Alright, let's go battle. Rumble. Boom! And play this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So we can turn completely sideways next turn. Uh, if they tap out. Oh, 
Oh my. This could be very bad for us. <laughs> Whenever they cast a non-creature spell, they get to draw a card. Sure. I love how they do it on a tapped creature. That's fine. Hmm. Yeah. So they created more treasures. We did get rid of the treasure cove. So that was good. Oh boy. What does that hit? Sure, sure. Um, I guess. So if we attack all, they block here. That's 7, 10, that's 20 damage. They got 1, 2, 3, 4. So they are probably holding up Settle the Wreckage. I don't think I need to attack with everything. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. This costs six, so I can make three four four nine swords of trample. Oh, okay, sure. So I don't need to um uh, if I just play this. I don't really need to commit to anything more. I can just create start creating dinosaurs. Oh maybe I should oh Oh, I didn't know they gave him trample. Oh, that was dumb. I'm sure they have a wrath. They have half of their deck in their hand. <laughs> sure, sure. I just get rid of that card, shouldn't I? Oop. Probably played that wrong. Probably should have held on to Basiju and just used this instead. That way, if uh, if a wrath comes, I still have Basiju on hand and could kill the glass casket at like a, at an end step or something. Yeah, I think I played that backwards. That's okay. Yep, midnight clock, okay. Celestis. Let's see how they tap their mana. They're probably going to play as much as they can and still leave up four, so like these two treasures. And, um, oh, I think they're just, they're done with their turn. Okay, oh, darn it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's uh shoot. Missed that at the end step. Okay. Let's, let's get in there with this. I wanna get in there with exactly 18 that will prompt them to use their subtle. Yeah, that's oh shoot. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, so they do have settled the wreckage. Okay. Yep. Go, 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 go
grab some land. Thank you. Um, play Soul of the Harvest. Draw some cards. Oh boy. Play land. I'm gonna kind of smell this. Oh yeah, there you go. All right. Um, Rover the Mighty. Kind of want to just fill our hand again. Of course, let's draw some cards. One and two. And play this. Draw some more cards. Perfect. Um, I think we'll end the turn. And we'll get rid of these three cards. Or is it two? Two cards. Baiting, sacking this to kill the clock or that, I guess. Mm, something huge. Oh, is this that planner cleansing again? Uh, how many cards? 32 cards left. Hmm. We'll just play this under turn. I don't think there's a reason to play this. Do we need 13 cards in our hand? Oh, undo inversion. Destroy all non impermanence. Yep. That is fun. There we go. Ooh. Probably play this. We can ninjutsu some stuff in here. We have some things. Yep. And we do we do have a layer of the hydra all right Enlightenment begins within there are 20 though oh man are you serious what does their deck do <laughs> that's so lame uh give me more land thank you This, uh, probably do layer, sure. Yeah, breathe in, exhale. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, come on. Lame. Sure. Why does this cost so much? Has he died that many times? Goodness. I guess he's never coming back. Um. Can't give this haste or anything. Really? I just leave this as a land. Oh, well. Mm hmm. Pay the one. Pick. Do, do, do. All right. I don't think we have very many options. I'm gonna start drawing cards this way, I guess. Perfect. Yep. We're getting life. Okay. Play this. Gosh, I should play this first. Good news, uh, they have, they're down to five cards in hand. <laughs> uh, bad news, I don't have very many creatures in my hand right now. Think, then act. Oh yeah. Smash and kill this, what is this, that one? Who cares? In no, <laughs> my dinosaur. How dare they? I'm gaining too much life. In. Beat him up. All right. I have 25 cards left in our deck. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yep. To open the mind, you this must thing's getting up there. It's at three. Let me can rumble in for. 
for four at his head. We're here. Oh, I like that idea. One, two, three, four. Yes. No. Oh my gosh. Yep. My apologies. I lost my focus. Oh. Goodness gracious. I need twenty two mana to cast this thing. <laughs> That's four turns. We're not immediately dying. Do they have more removal? Let's see. Perfect. Probably the better to draw a card or pump this up. I don't know. What do we get back if we connect with Springleaf Avenger? Oh, bleh. This thing. This isn't a fight you can win. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I've got it. All right, let's pump this up. And draw a card. Okay. Okay, so I think I can go here. Of course. So play this. Play this. Yep. And end the turn. Destroy all creatures. Yep. I'm running out of cards. Ooh, yeah. I've got time. All right, play both. Enchantments you control? We don't have that many enchantments. Well, they can't counter it, but they can probably destroy all my stuff. Doom scar. Let's just play this. Passing our journal again. Oh boy. 
Oh, this game is going on to the end, all the way down to the last card. Here we go. What else to do? Kugla. <laughs> That's all I got. Oh my gosh. <laughs> sure. Yep. Yep. Time to test the storm amplifier. Do 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 do. All right, more planeswalkers. Let me demonstrate the prowess of my yep, ancestors. Yep. Here goes nothing. Sure. Breathe in. Exhale. Okay. How about we play this? And we play this. We'll go and draw a card. Oh. Yep. Sorceries being instant. So most of his removal has been all at sorcery speed. Meditate with me. Hmm, that's kind of funny. All right. Because I think anything I cast is probably going to be counterspelled or destroyed. Auto pit. Why did this not attack? This cannot block flyers or non flyers. Rumble. All right, who am I gonna pick on? Oh, it does not have haste. Oh shoot, it's not the one that has haste. Oh, well. <laughs> oh we finally did. Enlightenment begins within. Oh, what? Goodness. Time to test the storm amplifier. <sighs> no, I am not making this up as I go. Another land. Okay. Well, what do we have here? One, two, three. 
let's tap all our land. We will tap all of our land. Okay, so we have 11, so we can pump 10 into this. Bam. Oh, there we go. Boom. So we can go kill some planeswalkers. Except for this one. Smash. Oh. That's not good. That's gonna be the game. I've got other things to grow. Is it just me, or is it getting a little warm in here? Right. Hmm. I have some bad news for you. We are just about dead. Don't worry, I got this. Oh, that was rude. To open the mind, you must first open the heart. Just take a moment and cool off. Boom. OMG. Oh yeah. Alright, what are we blowing up? What's under there? That guy? Anything else that's interesting? What's under there? Oh yeah, get that card. Of course. Sweet. Uh, let's give this haste. And it's dead. <laughs> oh, darn. Uh, sure, let's get reach. Why not? Hope it's not too hot for you. So we are. So they have to play. How does this work? Not this. Let me see. This. Whenever you cast a copy of it, whenever you cast or copy an instant or sorcery, this deals one. So he just has to cast a spell. Sure, it's no good. And then we did it. We are dead. Oh, we get to scry? Oh, my goodness. Um. Okay, resolve, resolve. Sure. Let's. Can we flip? We can! We can flip it! But we can't pay for this life crash with Crafter's Bestiary. Well, psh. Psh. Sure. <laughs> Take that. Draw zero. Aha! GG. All right, welcome to the post games where we do a little bit of analysis of our deck here after playing a couple games. That last game, oh my gosh, that last game lasted a long time. But um, man, we we held out all the way right up to the end, and uh, we lost. But not bad for a creature based deck to to outpace our opponent in card advantage. But um, kind of just gassed out right at the end. But um, yeah, let's take a look at the deck. Let's uh, see what was good, what was bad. You know, um, the more I play with this card here, this Ascendant Pack Leader, the more I, the more I love this card, especially in this kind of deck, right? Um, so uh, it just gets bigger with every four mana or greater spell that you have. So uh, it itself is growing. And making this cheaper. That's a great combination. I think that's really good.
cool design on this card. Um, I like it in this style of deck, especially when you're playing with cards like, um, oh, where is he? Gore Claw. Oh my goodness. Not only does it make your uh, creatures with the power four or greater cost two less, like, like this Galta, but it also will pump this up. A lot of synergy in this deck that goes all around. Um, I think it, I think it, every card that we played w was pretty good. Um, I don't think there was like one misstep of a card. Like, I mean, there was a time we had harmonize in our hand, but the rest of our deck was just drawing cards way better than what the harmonize could do. Maybe we take that out, right? Um, the one time we saw this card was late in the game and it was already too late. So the idea of this card was get this out on turn three. And this essentially is um, a six mana uh, sink into this Galta. That's half. That's half of his casting costs right there in this one creature. But we didn't get to see that in the early game. And that's okay. Um, but the, the one card I didn't really care for was this runic ar armor sore. Eh. <laughs> um, but eh, everything else kind of did its own thing. I don't really know. Like maybe this. I don't really know like what else I would replace this with. The only reason I put it in here was to turn out large creatures in the end game where you draw your extra lands, you don't really need them. Um I I don't know. <laughs> uh, I really wish we could have uh attacked with this. Unfortunately, uh we didn't. As it was counterspelled every time <laughs> but uh, fun deck I mean it's, it's just creatures and attacking it's not much more you can do about it but um, let's go and crack open a pack and then we'll hop over to the randomizer all right let's see what we get with nuke penna Oh, okay. Do like these lands. These are these are very nice. These uh, cycle of lands here. That's a good pickup. So let's hop over to the randomizer and see what we get. All right, we're on the randomizer here. Let's go ahead and hit that button. Four twenty-eight. 428. What is that? Ooh, Valentin, Dean of the Vein. All right, let's hop over into the arena again and see what that is. Okay. So here we have it. We have Valentin, Dean of the Vein, which is a flip card, a black card green flip card with Lisette Dean of the Root. So a menace lifelink. If a non-token creature an opponent controls would die, exile it instead. When you do, you may pay two. If you do, create a 1-1 one, one black and green pest creature token. When this creature dies, you gain one life. And on the flip side, it says whenever you gain life, you may pay one. If you do, put a 1-1 counter on each creature you control, and those creatures gain trample until end of turn. Okay, so, um, yeah, I'm going to see what I can build with this in the next one. But uh, I just want to thank everyone again for tuning in. If you stayed this long, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. And I'm going to be signing off, and I wish everyone a good night. So take care.